Greetings, everybody. I am Lobo, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. The gameplay demo. We have one hour to do this. We have both the village and castle demos available to us this time, and I intend to play through both of them, especially the village demo, because I did not get through it the first time. We had a half hour, and I got kind of lost and was meandering, which is common for me in first playthroughs. This time, we're just going to kind of speed through the whole thing. Not a speed run. We're just going to move kind of fast. And that's not the only change we're going to make. This time, we're going to play it in hardcore difficulty. We're going to let them hit us with all they got. Ethan's daughter, Rose, has been kidnapped. He now finds himself in a strange village. After wandering for a while, he comes across an old woman. In life and in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? Oh, it's you, the child's father. Child? Hey, wait, do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? Castle Bell heralds danger. They're coming! <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. They're coming again! <laughs> Rose is here? Well, she's, uh, she's friendly. Not especially helpful, but she is friendly. Now, as I said, uh, we're going to kind of move quickly through this. We're going to play this as if Ethan is a man on a mission, right? We're going to play this as if he he's reconned the area. He knows what he needs to do. He knows pretty much everywhere he needs to go. Because at this point, I pretty much know what I need to do. I know where I need to go, right? And we're going to do things a little bit differently. For instance, last time we didn't smash these, but this time we're going to do that. Because you know what? I've had it with Mother Miranda and all her hijinks. And I know there's an herb over here somewhere. We're going to grab that so we can go ahead and craft up a first aid med. It's somewhere over here. I know because I've watched other people play the demo and I've seen a lot of stuff that I've missed. Now, we're not going to get everything that i missed, but we're going to get some stuff, right? Uh, so, yeah, I've seen, I know what's going to happen here. But, you know, if you guys have only watched a demo that I played through, then you guys haven't. And I feel kind of bad for that. This is where uh, we need to go, by the way. We need to... to the castle. Yes, we need to solve this puzzle right here. And we know where the first uh, the first piece of this puzzle is. It's right through here. So we're going to go ahead and grab the Maiden Crest. And since we are in the area, we might as well go ahead and stick this piece on the puzzle and clear up a little bit of inventory space, right? So we'll just pop that in right here, rotate it the proper way, and then we are good on that. All right, so now we need the second piece of this puzzle, which means... We're going to have to go through here. Actually, I could have probably just gone around the building, but you know what? We're going to go through there, and yeah, we're just going to go ahead and proceed through the uh, through the dangerous field because there's bad stuff over there. We know that, right? We know that from the first time we played through here. And you know what? Since uh, we are playing on hardcore mode, and I've never played a Resident Evil game on hardcore mode before, we're going to go ahead and barricade ourselves in here just like that. So now we can go ahead and pick up some stuff in hopefully relative peace. I don't know. We'll see how this works out for us. Can I actually make ammo yet? No, I need two of each. Okay. That's fine. We got okay. the shotgun. How many shells we got in this shotgun? What are we looking at here? One. Excellent. But we do have a mine. I kind of want to use the mine. I mean, we're having fun, right? Let's go ahead and, and use the mine. And see if we can lure a werewolf over to the mine and then, uh, you know, just see what happens. For science. For science. I mean, we know these werewolves are bad. We're not giving them any warnings. We know that they do some bad stuff. So we're, nope, I want my mine. We're just going to pluck that bad boy down right there and, uh, hey, Wolfie, who's been a bad wolf? Come here, I got a, I got a surprise for you. Hello? Is he going to come after me? Knock, knock. Wolfie. Okay. Well, kind of wasting valuable time here. And if you're not going to come after me, then maybe... 
Maybe I just need to come to you, right? That is probably what needs to happen here. Yeah, I think so. Okay. All right, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna pick this up, right? And we're gonna run through the minefield, and we're gonna plug this down the other side. And I'm sure by that point, we will be uh, being pursued. So that's the plan. Kind of risky, but I'm willing to take a chance because you know we've already played through this. We're having a little bit of fun, right? Oh, okay. Well, there you are. Okay, I got a little. I got I got a surprise for you. There you go. Ow! You missed it. Oh, your friend got it though. Okay, at least we got to see that. Uh, excuse me. I need to go inside. I'm done playing. Close the door. Please. Yep. Hey, what are you doing here? Stay back. Please, don't hurt us. Whoa. It's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just glad to see normal people at last. Have you seen any other survivors? No. They're all in Louise's house. And she's not answering and the gate is locked. Quiet girl. He's an outsider. Oh. Shit, we're setting ducks in here. Can your old man walk? No. One of the monsters cut him. He's lost a lot of blood. We have to get into Louise's Shh, house. Quiet. Must be a way inside. Stay here. Be quiet. Don't move until I get those gates open. <coughs> All right. So we'll go ahead and quickly get those gates open. Get uh, Elena and her father to safety. Safety, huh? That's not something I can do yet. I gotta say, um, it's a lot less intimidating when I actually know what's coming. When I know what to expect. I can guarantee you the uh, playthrough of Resident Evil 7 I did, my first playthrough of that that I'll be uploading shortly, that's uh, going to be nothing like this. <laughs> nothing at all. Come on, it's clear. Uh, hurry, hurry. Uh, took your damn time. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> He's not used to relying on other people. I'm sorry. Oh no. Oh, that's We're fine. Here, won't we? Oh, Safer no. here than out there, that's for sure. Hey, do you know anything about what's going on around here? It doesn't make any sense. Mother Miranda has always protected us. Nobody's answer. Father? <laughs> we have to get inside. Um, again, not over there. Over here, already on it, Elena. Hello? Anybody home? Maybe a familiar voice. Louisa! Open up! It's me, Elena! Stop shouting. You'll draw the monsters. Julian, calm down. Who's this? A friend! Stay back. <laughs> Father, for God's sake, Julian, let us in. No, no, they'll smell the blood. You'll endanger us all. My father will die out here. But that's not my problem. What's going on? These people want to let a dying man into our home. Come now, these people are our friends. Go on, go inside. Come now, this way. You're not from this village. Uh, no. I'm Ethan. Yulian, go make yourself useful and check the grounds. I said go! If Elena trusts you, then so do I. Come inside, Ethan. Well, I don't know if she trusts me. She just met me, but you know what? Your hospitality right here. is. I'll check on the others. All right, Louisa. I was going to tell you, your hospitality is appreciated. Hey, I'm going to snoop, all right? Let's go ahead and read this. We didn't read this last time. Louisa, they broke in again. Got more of the livestock. I don't think we'll make it through the winter at this rate. Ernest is still missing, too. We can't find him anywhere. Has Mother Miranda abandoned us? Oh, Mother Miranda's been doing some stuff. Are you ready yet? <laughs> All right. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and look at this. I don't know if this is like something we need to do to get her to. Oh, here we go. This way. 
Oh yeah, I know the way. I, I'm I know the way, Louise. I can, oh can't make myself at home, huh? You, you're right. I'm being an ingracious guest in your house. I apologize for that. That's my fault. Come I inside. That the look. others are waiting. The f is this? Oh, it's you. Outsiders, you're gonna get us all killed. Life, Anton. I can't stand this guy. He helped Leonardo and Elena. We were doing fine by ourselves. Please, Ethan, take a seat. Is this all that's left? From your entire village? All that's left? All that's left? There is no one left! A worthless invalid? A stupid, wailing bitch! And you! You drag a bloody man and an outsider in here like it's nothing? And expect to be all safe? There is no safe! Every Sorry bastard out there has been ripped in half. But tomorrow? <sighs> tomorrow we'll all be dead. Just like her damn husband. <laughs> Put a sock in it, Roxana! That's enough! This house has protected my family for generations. And drunk or not, you are all welcome and safe in here. Th Whatever. Can someone please tell me what the hell is going on here? We don't know. One day we were a quiet, devout village, and the next, the monsters came and attacked us. And they, they kept coming. Wait, Louisa, and... where is your husband? Did they? No. N no, he, he is out there. Somewhere. He, he, he went to get help. Yes, yes, that's... That's it. He, he went to fetch help. Let us pray. For him. For all of us. Good idea. Come. Gather. Great ones, hear our voice. Together as one in reverence, we call on thee. Within, within the endless, endless dark, to, to deliver us into fate's hands. As the midnight moon rises on black wings, so we make our sacrifice and await the light at the end. In life and in death, we give you glory, Mother Miranda. Now, the tea should be ready. Come help me, Elena, please. That prayer, I've heard it before. There was an old woman near the graveyard. <laughs> you mean the hag? <laughs> Some bitch is crazy as a bag of rats. There is wisdom in her devotion, though. And I hope it protected her as it shall protect us. <laughs> Here we go again. What are you doing? Leonardo, what's wrong? Are you okay? You still hate to see that. And that's still as unsettling as ever. Okay. Back up, please. No, no. Alright, you know what? I never liked you anyway, so. Okay. Well. Get off me, please. Get off me! Let him Elena? Go. Elena? I said no! Oh my god. I'm so sorry, Father. Hey. Hey. That wasn't your father anymore. You did the right thing. Elena, Elena, no! There's nothing you can do! Papa! This entire place is collapsing! No. No. You couldn't save him. He was already gone. Leave me alone! No, we're getting out of here. Together. 
I am sorry, Elena. I truly am. I got fun and games are over. Yeah, we're gonna get out of here, Ethan. We need the uh, truck key. Um, I just want to see if there's anything else we we should probably pick up first, like this herb right here. Uh, we do have a chem fluid, don't we? So we can go ahead and craft up another first aid med for ourselves. And I'm not sure what else there was in here. So we're gonna just have a quick peek around. Ah, money! Yes. Let's rob the place while we're at it, you know? Otherwise, it's just gonna get burnt up and that money's gonna go to waste, right? Uh, we are going to need the screwdriver out of this, so let's go ahead and unbutton. Get that out. Perfect. We'll use that a little bit later. And I don't think there was anything else in here. Oh, no, I was wrong. We almost passed up on some shotgun shells. We're gonna go ahead and, uh, and take those. Those might be essential to our survival, you know? <coughs> Alright, Elena. Damn, let's, uh... The fire's moving fast. <sighs> yep. Let's go ahead and, uh, <coughs> attempt to get out of this place. What are you thinking? Step back. We can bust out with this. What am I thinking, Elena? I'm thinking I'm gonna drive headfirst into a brick wall. That's what I'm thinking. You know why? Because these are crazy times we live in, Elena. Crazy times! Let's do it! We're good! Alright, Elena, I'm gonna just try that again. It didn't work the first time, so let's just go ahead and, uh... Give it another shot! There we go! I'm, I'm fine. Let me back up again. The fire. There isn't any time. <coughs> More to go, but up. <coughs> Grab on. Hurry. <coughs> Let's move. Don't worry. And try not to breathe in the smoke. I know. Thank you, Ethan. <coughs> You're kind. I hope your family is safe. I do too. Once we get out of here, maybe you'll get to meet them. <coughs> Come on. It'll hold. <coughs> there. That's our way out. Oh, thank God. But then, the village is still full of monsters. We can't fight them, there's too many. Hey, hey, don't talk like that. We'll find a safe house to put you in until I can find my daughter. My hunch is she's in that old castle. No, that place is full of nothing but blood and death. And I don't want to be alone while you're... Father? <gasps> Elena, no, that's not him, not anymore. <laughs> he said my name. Wait, it's not safe! Uh. Stay there! Come on, give me your hand! Ethan, go! Save your daughter! Elena, don't give up! Reach for me! Everyone dying on me. This is, this is just too much. Yeah, it sucks. That sucks. Elena didn't deserve that. She was cool. I liked Elena. All right, so we didn't get this far before, so this is uh, this might be I new just to. Don't get it. Yeah, I don't, I don't know, Ethan. But we need to keep moving. We need to find Rose, right? That's what we need to do. This place is going mad. Why the f is this happening again? <sighs> Shit! I don't know, man. I don't know. You know, we need to, we we just need to stay out of these situations, okay? We keep getting ourselves in this mess, and it's not good. It's not good for your mental or emotional or physical well-being. We need to just distance ourselves from it, go play some video games. 
This is what we needed that screwdriver for, by the way. We need to go ahead and open this up. Then, grab the demon crest out of here. And that's going to give us access to the castle. Bring us one step closer to finding Rose, right? Can't go that way. Oh! Don't like that sound. Who's there? Oh, stop! Mother Miranda! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> who, who was... What was that? Again. I don't know, Ethan. I have no idea what's going on here. This is a town of crazy people. There's some bad stuff happening here, Ethan, and, and my curiosity is not piqued. If not for Rose being trapped in that castle, believe me, I'd be long gone. So, uh, what do you say we just go ahead Death. and... Huh? Yes. Death has visited them all. <laughs> It's not funny when death visits. He's not hilarious, old lady. What's she drawing down there? I don't even care. I got stuff to do. I gotta go save Rose. I don't have time for your nonsense. Alright, let's go ahead and put the uh, demon crest in the, in the puzzle door right here. And that will give us access to the castle. And also, the uh, second part of this demo. Nothing but blood and death. Huh? Hey, there we go. So we completed the village demo. I am going to go ahead and do the castle demo too, even though we did complete it. We didn't complete it on hardcore. So, let's get into it. Y'all ready for this? I'm ready for this. Ethan's daughter might be in the castle. He entered the looming castle with a single ray of hope of finding her. What he found instead was a most unpleasant welcome. Alright, so yeah, we did beat the castle when we played through this demo before, but we're going to do it again on hardcore mode, you know, for completion's sake, right? Uh, and I guess while we're, you know, wandering the castle, there's no real threats to us here at the start. So let's go ahead and talk about, uh, you know, some upcoming uploads, some variety we're going to be adding to the channel. Obviously, I'm very excited about Resident Evil 8, um, so we're going to eventually play that, but I have played Resident Evil 7, and I will get those up uploads to you eventually, um, but I do have another few videos I recorded like a month ago that I've been waiting to get edited and, and uploaded, and that will come later this week. My friends are over here. There's my little friends. I miss you guys. So... Following that, we will start uploading Resident Evil 7 videos. I will try to get those edited and, and all ready to go fairly soon. And then after that, sometime after that, we'll uh, we'll do Resident Evil 8. Let's go ahead and uh, pluck the eye out of this ring while we're over here, right? Let's go ahead and do that because we're going to need that a little bit later. Um, and we're going to kind of... I mean, we moved through this demo fairly quickly the last time we played it, but... Um, we're probably going to go a little bit quicker this time just because there's no real need to search around and, you know, do stuff. Because what I'm basically taking Rose. What I'm basically going to do is just buy whatever I need. Oh, we meet again. Duke, why are you here? Where there's coin to be made. <clears throat> and have you found your daughter? No. If she is truly here, the Lady of the Castle would have kept little Rose in her private chambers, would she not? Don't we trust her? her? The very same. Why don't you take a look? Maybe you'll get lucky. And speaking of looking, care to make a purchase? Oh, yes. Absolutely, the Shall Duke. Shall I choose something for you? Oh, no, I got this. I know Please exactly what I'm looking for. Please do take a look for. at my new stock. Yep, in a second, I got some stuff for you. Some stuff to add to your stock. How about that, the Duke? Okay. Alright, now we're in business. So what I think I'm going to do is go ahead and buy a shotgun. So we can have a little fun when we get down to the dungeon, right? Because I don't believe we have the shotgun on us from the you previous demo. You let me demo. know if you find anything else of value. 
Oh no, I'm not done yet. Oh good, I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not done yet, the Duke. I'm gonna go ahead and buy this I thing right here. This one makes itself useful. I won't be your best customer, the Duke. There we go. That's expensive, but we got that. And yeah, I mean, we could have done Securing upgrade. goods is more, and please come again. Oh, I'm sorry. I keep flagging you. I don't mean to do that. I swear, that's not my intention. We could have done an upgrade, uh, but I think ammo is probably more important. And considering the last time we did like a knife only run through the dungeon because, uh, you know, we had some difficulties. We had to we had a weapon malfunction. Um, you know, I'm thinking that uh, we might, you know, actually tear some stuff up when we go down there this time, okay? I don't believe there was anything we really needed on this side, but I want to have a look around just in case, because I really don't remember. Um, you know what we could do? We could return to the Duke and buy some handgun ammo, too. That, that'd probably be a good idea. Just so, you know, because we are in hardcore mode, and there was a lot of dudes down there last time, so that might be a good idea. Um, but... We were talking about adding a little bit of variety to the channel. It's not just going to be horror games. It's not just going to be Resident Evil. I plan to play all kinds of different games, you know? I have fun. And I want you guys well, to have fun, then, too. feel free to peruse. All right. So, we can't afford any upgrades, but... What are but, you buying? <laughs> just something an old friend of mine used to say. Uh, that's funny, the Duke. I need, uh... I mean, this is what we came here for, right? But this, this might actually come in handy. So let's go ahead and purchase one of these. Uh -huh. And then we'll spend the rest of our money on uh, on handgun ammo. How does that sound? Sounds like a plan to me. Yes, I can see why you'd be interested in that. Oh, I'm sure Until you can. Next we meet. All right, it's been a pleasure, the Duke. Really love doing business with you. You're, you're my favorite. You're my favorite. You're not as cool as Elena. She was my favorite. In fact, the Duke... You know what I'm going to say? I'm going to say that you are my second favorite. And that is a huge compliment because Elena was awesome. She's going to remain my favorite. Her memory lives on. You know why? Because she was a lovely young woman. In a very messed up situation taken far too soon. Alright. Let's go ahead and get into some mess. Shall we? You still Let me won't. String you up, slice your jugular, and just watch. I'd Take rather a you live, didn't. dead. Which would you prefer? Very much alive and very much untaken. Is that an option? You know what? There's gonna have to be an option because uh, I'm alive and untaken. All right, let's go ahead and see what the lady of the house is up to. Actually, you know what? There was something over here, right? Yeah, rush this crap. Can we use that to make any more handgun ammo? We cannot, but that's all right, because the Duke is, uh, he's keeping us well supplied. He's keeping us all stocked up, so I don't really need anything more than him, at least to make it through the demo. Ah, yes. Still enjoying her wine and her music. I respect that. I respect that. You know, Ethan, we need to have a talk. We need to talk about how you keep getting yourself into these situations. These supernatural situations. These... Really, really terrible, terrible situations you keep getting yourself into, Ethan. Some kind of adrenaline junkie, is that it? Hmm? We need to talk about this. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, do this puzzle. We just need to light these little side things. There's one. And where are you? There you are. Come over here. I need you to join me over here on this side. There we go. Alright, and this is uh the terrible part. I wasn't going to say the fun part but it's more terrible than it is fun. Especially when you don't have a weapon running through here like I did last time. Oh, I was brandishing that weapon all right, but that, that didn't seem to phase our friends down here at all. Uh, so we did kind of rush through here. You guys need to secure your stuff. I'm tired of telling you that. Secure it or lose it. Um, we kind of rushed through here last time. I'm going to try to look around a little bit more, except for there's... Okay, well, you guys are... Not fun to get close to, so maybe, maybe what we'll do 
<laughs> it's the same strategy we did last time, but with a little more, uh, little more flair. How about that? How about that? You, they, uh, they are taking those shotgun shells like a champ. They're getting right back up. All right. Let's just go ahead. Let's just move on. You know, I didn't really want to hang out. Oh, okay. Oh, this is going poorly. Worse than I hoped. You know what? I just need to remember to block. I remember to block. Everything's going to be just fine. I am trapped in a corner. I don't like this. We need to get out of this corner. We need to go up these stairs. You, this is where I want to be. From here, we can go anywhere. I need an exit strategy. All right. Who wants the last two? You. Here. Have both of them. All right. We need to move. <laughs> we need to move. We need to get out of here. All right. Can't go that way. That's fine. We don't need to go that way. We need to go this way, right? I can't believe Cassandra caused all this mess. Oh, yes. Yep. Cassandra caused a hu huge mess. You should really go talk to her about this. Not me. <laughs> oh. Hi. She doesn't care if I'm blocking. That's that's good to know. This is the wrong way. We don't want to be in here. Hi. Excuse me. Coming through. Okay. We need to egress. We need to get out. Out in a hurry. This is also the wrong way, but we got some more shotgun shells. Okay. Where are you going, little one? You know where I'm going. You know, don't act like you don't know. Straight into your belly. That's where I'm going. All right. Well, there is the castle demo. That was fun. This game is a lot of fun. It's fun when it's not scary. It's scary the first time, fun the second time. All right. Let's watch the trailer. Midnight moon rises on black wings. We await the light at the end. In life and in death, glory to Mother Miranda. When you're whining, we're almost there. <laughs> Where are you? Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my... to Louisa's house near the fields. Long, long ago. Oh, no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? Stop shouting. You'll draw the monsters. Tell me what is going on around here. It doesn't make any sense. Mother Miranda has always protected us. You escaped my little brother's idiot games, did you? Let's see how special you are. Is this all that's left from your entire village? All that's left? There is no one left! We can bust out with this. Lycans and gentlemen, we thank you for waiting. And now let the games begin! There is no safe! Every sorry bastard out there has been ripped in half! Tomorrow we'll all be dead. No, let me go! Chris? What the hell? Why? Ethan Winters. Ethan Winters, Mr. Winters. Ethan Winters. Ethan. Poor Ethan. Ethan Winters. Welcome. Get off of me! Stay the f*** down! I gotta say, I'm surprised you made it this far. It'd be a shame if something happened to you now. You killed Mia. Now do me and finish the job. 
And there we go. That is the Resident Evil 8. The Resident Evil Village Village and Castle Demos. And I can't wait to play this game. It's going to be a lot of fun. I'm really looking forward to it. This actually got me wanting to play Resident Evil 7. So I did that. And as I said, those videos will be up shortly. Uh, I do have a few other videos that, that are going to be, you know, uploaded before them because, you know, I played them earlier. But, you know, life, life, you know, those videos have just been sitting around waiting, waiting to be edited, waiting to be uploaded, waiting for you guys to view them. It's currently where Resident Evil 7 is, waiting to be edited, waiting to be uploaded and all that stuff. Uh, I will say, don't expect me to play Resident Evil 7 the way I just played this demo here. Things are completely different with that because that was my first playthrough of a full Resident Evil game since Resident Evil 5 and that was maybe a decade ago. So I, you know, I'm moving a lot more cautiously. I'm making a lot less jokes. The only thing you're really going to be laughing at is how bad I am at that game. But, you know, I'm just saying, manage your expectations. But <laughs> I do think that's probably going to be it for us here today. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, and I hope you guys are looking forward to a little bit more variety in the channel. So if you are, if you did, you know, hit that little thumbs up button. Let me know. And if you want to see more, please remember to subscribe. But as always, I just want to thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I deeply appreciate it. And until next time, I am Lobo, and I will see you guys later.